Wrestling is fast becoming a growing sport in Senegal, but the West African country could soon become a powerhouse in another form of wrestling. Pamara Dabo says he has made it his life to carry on a family tradition, teaching the Japanese style of sumo. A few decades ago, his late father traveled to Japan to learn judo and came back with video cassettes of sumo before opening Senegal's first dojo. Two things link me to Samo. First love for Samo. My father was the first to practice here and he taught me. For me, it is a legacy that I have to continue. Then the fact that here in Senegal, we have our own form of wrestling that is not so different from Somo. Famara has been training students in Sumo since 2007 in the capital Dakar and now here in his hometown, Mbur. Over recent decades, several foreign wrestlers have come to dominate the Japanese sport and now some Senegalese are hoping to get in on the act. Three times a week, Famara and around 10 of his students train on the beach. These young fighters you see are my students. They have started. They practice traditional Senegalese wrestling and Soma, the two at the same time. These young people want to learn Soma and develop Soma in this area. I wanted to come back to the town of my birth, Mambo, to try and develop and expand Soma here. Their equipment was brought back from Japan 20 years ago by Famara's father. Senegal's fledgling Sumo Federation has only 30 members, but interest is growing. I think with what we learn here, if I ever have the chance to go to Japan, I think I could make a name for myself. You have to understand that Sumo is not a matter of weight or strength or overall size. You've just got to be smart. With all these passionate young people, Famara believes that Senegal could produce future Sumo world champions. Bureau Report, ANN7.